I've always been kind of curious as to what uh, to say to people when they look at bonsai and like, oh, buy a bonsai, it'll it'll improve your life and it'll make your hair grow in thicker and it'll you know, <laughs> you'll get, get a promotion at work for sure. And I never know kind of what to say about people or to people about bonsai. But I think I can start saying that there's like the Japanese Zen in it. It's important to keep your bonsai garden looking sharp all the time. And also, a lot of bonsai techniques and tricks, um, people describe it as patience, but really it's monotonous. And, um, you know, the whole point is to kind of take a little bit of joy in not having anything complicated to do. So, I'm just sweeping up the cement. Uh, what is bonsai? I get asked a lot of questions about bonsai. I've, I've noticed there's a couple things that need clarifying about bonsai. So I've got this class section introduction to bonsai where I'll tell you what bonsai is according to Vancouver Island uh, here on the west coast in BC. Bonsai translates to plant in tray. Bon plant sai tray. Um, like with all names, it doesn't really encompass what bonsai is. You can't just slap some kind of plant into some kind of tray and make it into bonsai. You have to use uh, Japanese mentality. So, bonsai originated in China, um, but it moved over to Japan in the Middle Ages, became what we know and love, uh, became the concise uh, horticultural and artistic technique that we know bonsai is today. Uh, bonsai as a technique can be done to a great variety of species of trees and shrubs. Um, it can be done to indoor and outdoor plants. However, the traditional pines, the traditional junipers, and the traditional Japanese maples, they're all outdoor plants and have to be kept outdoor. Bonsai as we know and love it actually originated in China, came over to Japan in the Middle Ages, um, became codified became the precise uh, set of activities that bonsai is today in the world. Uh, bonsai is not a Japanese species of plant. It doesn't grow all twisted and strange. It's actually a set of horticultural and artistic techniques used to age a plant, a plant's appearance, or to maintain that plant if it's already old in a nice artistic way. Bonsai is a pet. You have to love it like a pet. It's not a plant. It's not a house plant, it's not a garden plant, uh, it's a pet. You gotta nurture it and feed it and love it and pay attention to it every day. Uh, bonsai is a very old art, but it's worldwide now. It's practiced by the Italians, the Canadians, the Americans, of course the Japanese, the Koreans, uh, you name it, they've got Bonsai India. And, but anybody can get into it, no matter where you are, where you come from, where you're living, what kind of plant you're working with. And it's really only as hard as you want to make it. Um, it just takes time. That's what it takes. Monotony. Um, monotonifying. <laughs> monotonifying? <laughs> How about monotonous? Uh, feel free to wear a NIOSH 95 approved dust mask. That'll actually quite short. You'll have 